It is Monday, June 24th, and it is my third week doing 75 hard. If you saw in last week's video, which was my second week, you guys are seeing that I'm not vlogging on Sundays just so I can have a day to not have to worry about like getting all these shots and stuff like that. Also, with that being said, since I will be uploading weekly consistently, hopefully, I hope that like, my brain can get a little bit more creative in certain things that I do or the way that I film something. I will obviously be doing a lot of the same stuff every single week and it's probably gonna get boring if it's shot at the exact same angle every single week. And I don't wanna do that. I want to be creative. I also want my videos to be something that can like motivate you guys to go out and start 75 hard or start reading or I don't know, do something that you normally wouldn't do. But yeah, I just finished editing or uploading week one. I honestly feel stressed to get everything done to edit. You know, I haven't done an apartment tour in so long. I want to get an apartment tour up this week before my next 75 hard video. On top of completing everything after work and like getting to bed at a reasonable time. Yesterday, I spent the entire day editing. I cannot find my shoes. I don't see my Converse anywhere. Wait, <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> so I found my Converse. If you haven't watched my week one video or my week two video, go watch them, please. I need to invest in a legit gym bag because I just used that like pack backpack over there and it's like a $400 backpack. I really should not be taking that to the gym and throwing it around, but I've had it forever and it's very durable. So I'm gonna brush my teeth really quick because I don't like the taste the pre-workout leaves in my mouth. Okay, it's always so hard to film the entire workout. So I'm just gonna show you what I have queued up. So I'm gonna do this warm up. I'm gonna do upper body abs, abs, cool down. Um, and then that'll be my indoor workout and then I'm gonna just go for a walk after. There are also a lot of people in the other room working out, so I don't know if I really feel comfortable filming a bunch because if somebody walks in, I don't know, it's just so awkward. <laughs> like, why are you filming? You tell him he's all you see, tell him you got his keys cause you thought he needed them, but he's not coming back again. So he's gone, leaving then. You won't see him again. It was convenient, but you won't be staying friends. And you know that, sweetie, you know that. Think you knew it before, but you just ignored that. So now you won't take bets, but there's no refunds here. So you sort of hurt, it makes you see clear. Okay, so I just got home. I am very tired. Some days the workout's easy and other days it's like way harder. But anyways, I don't have time to make dinner because I'm going to watch Shrek at Red Rocks and I need to shower and stuff. this little Chobani yogurt. I think it's like nine grams of protein as well. These are like all really tiny pieces of bread. Like my hand in comparison is smaller or bigger than every single piece. So it is the end of Monday, but I still need to read. Oh, by the way, no, I didn't eat dinner again. Is this healthy? Probably not. But I had those 
like sandwich slices so thank god for that thank god for that i'll see you guys tomorrow morning good morning it's tuesday june what 25th i have to train this morning there's a new girl i'm gonna be 30 in 25 days and i want to have a birthday party I wanted to I don't want to anymore I wanted to throw like a birthday party for myself but then I just remembered last year when I did nobody showed up and that really hurt my feelings like three people came um, four people it wasn't the end of the world and I still had a good time they all canceled literally the hour before I don't want to throw a party this year put all this effort into something and then no one shows up again I am so sorry I did not film making my food and honestly it looks kind of engrossed engrossed it's just my breakfast hash i am just really not vibing with this week and this day i want to be off work i'm in a webinar right now for work changed into my gym attire and I am just not feeling good at all but I have to do my outdoor workout and I obviously I'm gonna go do my indoor workout here in a minute but oh my gosh like my stomach is just not feeling good apologies for the sound quality right now um, I don't have my mic connected that's why it sounds weird there are a lot of people in that half of the gym. There's no one in here right now. Um, kind of sucks because I wanted to use some more stuff out there, but I also want to film and like show you guys that I actually am working out. I've already been here for 20, oh my God, my battery's dying. I've been here for 25 minutes. So I have another 20 minutes to go. Okay, this is the workout that I'm gonna do. I have a 35 pound dumbbell here. Um, and yeah, you guys have seen me do this a while back, um, so it might look familiar, but I'm excited to do it because I remember this kicked my ass. You and I were both of different kinds of colors. I'm glad I'm not yours. Why am I feeling like want you to be more? smoked sausage stuff that I did last week but do better this time because last week I burned it because I was playing a game on my phone this is the god honest truth playing a game on my phone watching TV the timer went off and I was in the middle of my game and I was like okay let me finish this game and then I will go take it out I literally finished the game but then I played like three more games and then I was like oh my god my food like it had been an extra like five minutes at that point and when I took it out it was just burnt <laughs> I'm in the mood to go back into my bed and go to sleep. Bye. 
breakfast yet it is one o'clock and I'm starving so I had to take a break and start making some food and then I really need to get back to work and back on the grind but I have some turkey bacon going right now and I'm just gonna make that with two eggs and then toast with butter and jelly just been a really boring day at work it's supposed to be the most busy day at work but it's just not super easy to always get a bunch of collections and make a lot of money especially like i feel so much pressure because i am one of the top performing people that i always have to hit those numbers otherwise i personally feel like a failure even though you know if i miss it for one week obviously i'm not a failure but i feel that way and my bank account can feel it too i really try to keep myself at or around the same collections every week these are looking perfect Look how tiny these pieces of bread are. Like what? My computer is currently updating right now. So I'm going to use this time to take my lunch and read my 10 pages. I have been talking on the phone with my dad. He is gonna call me back right now. We're just going through some important stuff. So that's been taking some time. I haven't had a chance to go to the gym yet or walk outside, which luckily um, I haven't because it is raining outside. It's been raining every day this week. Yeah, maybe I will just end up doing some yoga on my balcony again. I don't like working out on my balcony because it's concrete. I did read at lunch, I didn't get any shots. I apologize for that. I just was focused on getting the reading done. It is 7-11 and I'm gonna do my indoor workout right now. I just got home from my walk. I only took a couple of clips. My neighbor was with me, but it was 45 minutes. It's 8.45 and I'm just gonna have a tuna sandwich for dinner. I love this tuna, it's so good. If you feel like it, you can cut up some celery or onions, but I just am in a hurry. It's already uh, nine o'clock and I would like to be in bed by like 10.
Good morning. I am having another annoying day. I accidentally woke up way later than I should have, so I'm frustrated about that because now I have to stay late at work. I just finished reading. I am about to start my period, so I, I think that's also why I'm just like in a bad mood every day and like so grumpy. But yeah, I like don't feel like going to the gym and doing like extremely heavy workout. Um, so I think I'm just gonna do, like I said, mat workouts at home for the rest of this week. I just finished reading. I am going to clean my apartment until 3 p.m. and then I'm going to get ready to go to the gym and work out, do my walk, and then I have a nail appointment because look at these bad boys. They look so bad, you guys. First of all, they're like crooked. At this point, I've had them for a month, okay? Look how grown out they are. They look a little crusty. I know the color is called put it in neutral and it's a dip powder, so if you are interested, that's what it is. <laughs>
Okay, I had to end that workout very abruptly because I thought my nail appointment appointment was at 5.30, but it was actually at 5. So I realized at like 4.50 that I had to go for my nail appointment. So I left really quick. I only got to do about 30 minutes of my workout, but I think that's good enough for today, honestly. It is what it is. I am still gonna go for a walk with my dog. He's eating dinner right now. I literally just got home. The lighting is not the best right now, but I honestly feel like not good right now. I feel kind of lightheaded. I ended up talking to my parents on the phone for a little bit and then it started getting dark so I had to go walk Oliver and do my 45 minutes and because it started getting dark and I wasn't feeling good already I decided to just walk around my building so I didn't really film that much because I don't want it to be too descriptive of like where I live. I have a Jimmy John's tuna sandwich. You guys, seriously, I feel so freaking weak. I, I cannot. Good morning. It is almost the afternoon. It is Saturday, June 29th. Uh, I'm so annoyed, but I kind of had a feeling this was gonna happen just because I know my body This is kind of how my menstrual cycle is it just really takes me out like it takes me out I woke up at 8 a.m. I really wanted to stay up and start editing and working on my video and like finishing my to-do list and stuff but I couldn't because I was in so much pain I feel like this this whole week has just been really rough for me mentally, I guess, and emotionally. So I'm really annoyed about that. I'm on my period. I started it this morning. I wanna punch a wall. Mm, this is really good. This may have to solve all my problems. You are so greedy. He never wants to hang out with me until I have food. I only have 40 minutes to edit this video. This Rice Krispie Treat is the only thing that I've eaten because I just got home. It's 2.20. I'm feeling very annoyed, but I'm going to work on last week's video for the next 30 minutes, and then I will check in with you guys. I'm going to do a home workout because I'm not feeling good. Then I'm going to get ready for dinner. So I got a little bit of editing in, not a lot of water in. I'm still cramping, I'm really annoyed. A 12 minute workout, I might just do this three or, well yeah, three times and then maybe do like some stretching for the last bit of my workout because I am just cramping right now and it is, <sighs> not fun today's workout is a low intensity slow workout actually really nice every time I do yoga I just get so sleepy it's so nice this is the workout that I'm doing I just got home from dinner. I put on some comfy shorts. It is um, eight o'clock. Like, 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 
I swear it really makes it 10 times easier going for the walk if somebody's going with you. Try to find a friend that's willing to go for a walk with you. It's beneficial for everybody. 